Hello, my name is Chorzy and welcome to my channel. This is the Battle Cats. Nailed it. Today, we're gonna be very crazy people. Very crazy indeed. We have five hours and 55 minutes left to get the third forms of our crazed cats. You know, the crazed cats are unbelievably strong. They're like the basic cats, but stronger. We're gonna start off with Cat Maniac over here. This is my squad so far. I'm using four meat shields. I think it might be a bit overkill, but we're gonna try nonetheless. We have a Kankin Cat for damage. I'm hoping his range won't be too short. I'm hoping like he won't get flinched over and over again and just die. Cause he's gonna be like a really big DPS help to our squad. We have our Titan Cat. We have Cyberpunk Cat for slowing them down, letting our team like do more damage without dying. I have my Sugoi robot here, of course, because he's a Sugoi robot. Uh, he's amazing, and um, what more do you want? Bahama Cat in second form here instead of like third form. I thought third form, yes, it could do some major damage here, but I was really scared of like not timing him right and him just dying outright. So I thought, okay, instead, let's get crazy Bahama Cat and slowly whittle him down that way. I'm thinking maybe we can do more damage this way instead and we can stack up more Bahama Cats this way instead. And then finally, we have the Ultraman himself. Recently upgraded to Max here, Ultraland Passalan. He's gonna knock them back, do some major damage. Now, if Ultraland Passalan can actually knock them back to the point where they're near the base, I then might actually start changing my squad up, use Warlock and Pierre instead, and actually like try and cheese it instead. Yo, your boy Chorzy has had a lot of help from you guys. I appreciate it. So many people gave me advice. I have mixed all of this advice together into one amazing strategy, which will hopefully work. I have no idea if it's gonna work or not. We're gonna use Sniper the Cat here, and I think we use Cat CPU just in case. Uh, you know what? I don't think we need Rich Cat. I'm gonna use Rich Cat anyways. Death Hawk, deadly, no continues. Let the battle begin. So I've watched a lot of videos on this already. I didn't want to like go into this completely blind. Oh, CPU stop. There we go. We want to slowly but surely put out like meat shields here. And I don't want to fill the board with too many meat shields. That's pretty much the suggestion to everyone is, hey, yeah, put in like, you know, four or so meat shields out into the field. Don't do too many of them. If we hit the base too early, it's all, it's all over. Right now, they're not dying. The meat shields aren't dying. Have we done too many? We've done five, okay? We've done like four. You know what? It's okay. They're dying now. Thank God. I'm thinking maybe with Sniper Cat, we don't actually need... Maybe just three meat shields will do? You know what? One more Racer Cat, just in case and kind of scared that we're gonna... You know what? No, no, no. We should have summoned him. I don't know, man. I'm freaking out. I want to make sure this works, okay? We're slowly but surely approaching max money. You know what? This big boy right here is gonna be next. This big boy's gonna be so slow at attacking... We have plenty of time to regain a lot more money. So we should be relatively fine. I think Bahama Cat might... You know what? Let's summon Psycho Cat instead. I think that's an okay move. And you know what? Bahama Cat as well. They're so slow at attacking. That's another reason for Bahama Cat. Is you can like maybe like... Oh no. Okay. No. It's not good enough. Okay. We f***ed up. We screwed up guys. We screwed up. <laughs> We royally screwed up here. That's okay. It's the first run of the day, okay? We're gonna have to do many runs here and see which one works out really well. Um, and we want to spam meat shields from now on here. So we got CPU now turned on to help me out. What we want to do is try and keep our big boy Ultraman alive. Whilst also like doing a lot of damage here. Hopefully the knockback will like knock them back further enough to help him out. So I'm kind of like doing nothing right now. And it feels good. Is it not bad good enough for us to like hit the base with Warlock and Pierre in future runs? Uh, I think maybe if we have like another cat to help out with the knockback. Maybe if we stack like two uh, Ultramans. Definitely yes. It's, it's doable. If you have Warlock and Pierre, I reckon you can cheat us to no end. If you have the right knockback cats. I was about to say this is going really well so far. But you know, Bahama Cat just died. So I guess... It's not going that great. The cooldown on all of our Ubers is slowly approaching the point where we can summon them again. We've got two Hacker Cats, which I think is pointless right now. Yo, right now, he's close enough to the base where I think Warlock and Pierre could actually do some damage to the base, I think. The stage is definitely cheesable. I'm not gonna be that guy who cheeses the stage. I know my channel's icon is literally like a block of cheese uh, wearing a beanie, but like, 
I'm not going to do that. Keep summoning meat shields to no end, please. Yo, why have you stopped summoning meat shields? Don't stop summoning the meat shields, please. Yes, fire the lasers. Okay, I've stopped CPU now because he kept spending the money on the wrong things here. We have to spam out the meat shields right now. He was not doing that. He was like, oh, no, no, let's do like the Uber carry thing. No, 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 no. Any advice to anyone at home doing this? Have the meat shields. Definitely have meat shields. If you have any strong hitters right now in your Uber category, I would strongly suggest using them. If you have no Ubers at this point, don't be doing this stage, maybe. Or try out other super rare cats. There are a lot of really strong super rare cats that can probably help you out. Okay, CPU cat, come back on again because we actually do have a lot of money. There goes my Ultraman. My blessed Ultraman is, is gone. I don't know if Kanka Cat is actually doing anything right now. I'm looking at Kanka Cat right now. Yeah, he's- Kanka Cat is a dead cat right now. Kanka Cat is doing jack crap. All right, well, I strongly suggest not bringing in Kank and Cat. That was a big mistake. My bad. Uh, Sukhoi Robot, please. You're our only hope. You are actually our only hope. Hacker Cat, are you even attacking them anymore? Hacker Cat's not even attacking the right targets anymore because they're two forwards, which means our Hacker Cat's not doing anything anymore, which is really bad. If we can knock them back with Ultraman, possibly you can start slowing them down with our Hacker Cats, but right now, that ain't happening. Yo, never mind. The... <laughs> The hacker cat got killed. We did summon a new one though. They're pushing us back a lot. It's getting a little bit scary now. Hopefully the guy will die soon. Hopefully you'll, you'll die soon. It'll be great if you just, just die. Soon. Time to turn off CPU cat. Gonna rely on my own fingers to work this magic out. Gonna really concentrate here on what I'm doing. Not so much the commentary, honestly. A lot of people do post commentary these days. Smart people, very smart people. <laughs> Don't let your eyes escape the screen here. What do we do in this situation here? You know what, CPU cat, turn on. I need you again, I need you again here. Ultraman, no! Ultraman, get back, dude, get back! Oh my god. Ultraman is gonna die. Can you please do one final attack, Ultraman? Oh, yes! Oh, it's a good attack. Oh, it gives a lot of money too. Unfortunately, the cooldowns are like nowhere near to being done. So right now, we are just buying time with meat shields. This is actually really bad. I was really hoping to do this first time. Keep on punching them, Ultralan. You got this, buddy. You couldn't do it for us, man. There's my Sugoi robot. He's out again, man. He is so good. God damn, he's I, I can't stress enough how great he is. Uh, actually, Chauncey Sugoi robot isn't actually a robot. Also, he's trash. You shut up. You shut your mouth, whoever said that. Here's our Lord of Xavier right now. Yo, could the Master A's, like, die? There's gonna be three of them now soon. How can they not do the whole dying thing that we're doing? We're doing the whole dying thing. They're not. That's unfair. You're running low on money here. Time to start doing magic fingers again. Like, we're not dead yet, so I would say we're doing well. If you're doing badly, you know, we would have lost by now. So, that's my logic right there. We're doing well because we haven't lost yet. Jesus Christ, this is actually like... When will it end? Summon lasers. There we go. I don't know what else to do here apart from like what I'm doing. I think literally it's just a game of waiting here. All we gotta do is just wait for hopefully someone to die here. Preferably them. Instead of us dying, I would like them to die instead. If that wasn't like obvious. Any moment now, Mohawk guy will die. Any, any moment now. Please? How is he still alive? How is this little cat so goddamn strong? We now have two Sogoy robots. This is this the end of you, Mohawk cat? I'm sorry, bro. You cannot beat this. Two Sogoy robots? Mm -mm. You thought one was tough? We have two of them now, and an Ultraman. Yo, 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 he did. We've won. That's it. Straight up. That was actually, that was easy. All right, tip time. Honestly, my biggest tip right now is to go somewhere else in someone else's video for a better guide. I am not very good at the game. However, if I was to give a tip right now, right here, like if you need a guide, check out uh, Lucas. Your heart is some good guides. There's a lot more people as well. I can't remember. Yeah, hey, check out Reggae as well. You know what? People don't give him credit. He's a smart boy. He knows his stuff. Watch him for like, if not for 
a guide, watch them for entertainment values. I'll leave all of their links in the description below just for you guys to check it out. And right now I'm just like pandering for time here just so the video is long enough for you to watch and also like so we can destroy the base. Can you destroy the base already please? Like I'm running out of stuff to say here which is concerning because that's what I do. I say stuff, you know. I play video games and I say stuff. Seriously though, please I'm <laughs> desperately running out of things to say. I suppose I can just like edit it so you know the base will get destroyed now. Drop rewards, super rare cats, crazed cats, true form received, unlock it after reaching level 20. Um, so I'm like a bad person because I didn't want to show you guys this because I know you guys would be really upset when you see this but like my crazed matcha cat is only level 12. <laughs> I know I'm sorry, I'm sorry guys, I'm sorry, I'll upgrade it very soon, okay? I'm sorry. <laughs> I just thought in my head that it's not necessary to like level him up so much because he's a meat shield. All he does is he'll get hit, he'll die, but he'll, you know, help me out a bit. That made sense. I'm sure it did. I'm sure it made sense. It buys me time. But suppose if you like level him up, he actually buys you more time because you have more HP. So I, I don't know. You know what? It doesn't matter. We're moving on. The gross maniac now. Apparently this is like one of the easiest ones to do. I don't remember the cheese method, but I'm pretty sure it does rely on octopus cat. My beloved baby boy, octopus cat. So the comment I'm reading right now is from laser demon frost mage. I know a lot of you guys have written down comments on like how to do the stage here and like many other stages as well. However, this is the first comment I found, so I'm gonna credit him. Or, you know, if I fail miserably, it's his fault. So, like, either way, I win. So he says, For Manic Macho Legs, use Only Wall or Craze Wall and Octopus. After that, pretty much Paris, Dragon, Spam, Cakewalk. I'm afraid I don't have the Spam Cakewalk cat. <laughs> See, that was a funny... It's a funny joke. Oh, you <laughs> suck. Laugh at the funny joke. Muscle party, let the battle begin, guys. So I want to use one row here. I'm pretty sure that's all I need. I'm not going to use any Ubers here just, just because, you know, it's a nice way of saying like, I'm not Uber carried, you're Uber carried. Yo. So my tactic here is to use octopus cat and meat shields for a while. And then like Paris cats and then like, Octopus cat. I should probably like watch a video on this or something like that, but I don't know. And I want to use cats with like a good range here as well. Yo, I want to stack up more more cats with damage, I think, maybe. Am I going to lose this? <laughs> I don't... I feel like this is really hard. I think I'm going to lose this at this rate. Can we, we, we need more damage. I think we need more damage. I Octopus cat, my baby boy, he's doing a good job here, of course. However, are you gonna summon more octopus cats as well? Keep on going, guys. You got this. We want to stack up the Paris cats. No, yo, we're, we're pushing them back though. We did kill one. We killed one. Okay, you know what? We killed one. It's working. We're really smart and we're also the best here. Could we kill more, please? Yo, we just killed more. All right, you know what? This is the best thing in the world. <laughs> oh, bless octopus cat and also like all the guides out there that are doing a much better job at explaining all this. Let me give it a crack at explaining all this. Um, they do wave attacks. Octopus cat blocks wave attacks. This allows us to like stack up Paris cat and dragon cat. Paris cat and dragon cat are used because they have a nice distance. By distance, I mean like a nice amount of range between them and the enemy so they don't get hit by any of their attacks, which allows us to stack them up and do a really good job here. Is that pretty much it? Is that how it works? I'm, I'm, you know what? I'm smart. I'm smart. Look at that. That's like a certificate for being smart. Actually, any idiot can do this stage. You know what? Stop bringing me down that one guy in the comment section. I know who you are. I know where you live. Live in Garbageville because you're garbage. Oh, you got him. You got him really good there. Um. Now we have Fish Maniac here. And you thought I was gonna do Fish Maniac. No, 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 no. We're gonna save that for like next month, by the way, guys. Um, mm -mm. I've heard that one's pretty goddamn difficult. I don't really understand it just yet. Don't worry, I will definitely fail at it. But like, you know, let me have like a month to prepare for it before I start failing at it. Anyways, guys, hope you enjoyed this one. And I'll see you another time. Bye, 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 Papa, 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 papa,
Ba 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 